everyone it's just a quick video as i promised that i'd do one a quick one every day um i don't think you can see my address there can you if you can we're all friends here aren't we so i've got a little bit of happy mail and i've got today's spending and um, this is really going to be a quick one because my videos lately are just ridiculously long so today i needed um coffee and i did treat the kids a little bit because it's friday and why not um, so we went to Aldi, um, again, ignore my disgusting nails. So again, I forgot my bag, which is becoming a problem because the 30p ago, but luckily I only need one today. Uh, I got one, um, I thought I'd try the, it's the coffee, but it's not like the cheapest one. It's the next one up and it's actually really nice. So don't worry about trying non-branded coffees if you're a bit of a coffee snob like me, cause I thought, do you know what? I'm going to give it a go and it's actually really nice and my son my eldest who was nearly 18 he loves coffee and he was like oh get this coffee again it's nice so it's like in a gold jar um i've got two jam roly polies for the kids again for their little treat after their teas because why not um and they all enjoyed it and then i got like these they're in like pizza boxes like what you'd get from domino's and they're like garlic breads again for the kids as a little treat um didn't need them but I was having spag ball for tea, so they went down really nice. Because I always do garlic bread with spag ball, or Ryan does when he cooks it. And yeah, it just, it felt like a real treat for them. Because they do, it did look like they'd come from Domino's or something. So we got three of them between, like, seven of us, which I don't really eat. And Imogen only had, like, one little bit, so it was plenty. Um, we got some beef mints, which... Funnily in Aldi, the 5%, which is usually more expensive, is cheaper than the 20%. Maybe it's because it's got less. I don't know, but 750 grams, which feeds us all fine because I have a child's portion and um, Imogen has a tiny portion. So, And then we needed some sugar, which I couldn't believe how much it's gone up. £1.9. What? And then I got some bolognese sauce because who has time to sit and smash tomatoes <laughs> i know that you can have her make it and you know with like passata and stuff but no nah, I, I can't be bothered with that i'm not that type I'm sorry if you want that type of um parenting round here it's just not going to happen if it's spag ball it's in a jam unfortunately <laughs> i'm not i mean i could i have in the past when i used to do something well make it all from scratch but yeah it's just spag ball in it like who cares but yeah so spent £16.90 and then we went to Heron's because I'd forgot the custard and Ryan actually bought the custard and he put it on his card so I didn't ask him to so I don't see that as a cheat because he was buying us both a drink and um, yeah so that's not a lie either honestly I didn't ask him to he just bought it and I was like Oh, I've got the money in. He was like, don't worry, I'll put it on my card. So we did get some custard as well. Um, and then when we came out of parents, Ryan was like, oh, I've got to run back in for some batteries. And I was like, oh, I haven't really got money for batteries today. We'll have to get them tomorrow. And then he was like, oh, don't worry, I'll pay for them. And I was like, oh, I've got my household fund. So um, I ended up spending £2 on the household fund, which is pretty non-existent now. I'm looking at it, like, in here. And it's got pound fifty. So, yeah, we're still leaving it in there till Tuesday, though. And do you like money envelopes? If you didn't see yesterday's video, how cute are them? Absolutely love them. So, yeah, we've got left £3.10, which again, I'm not, I'm still not seeing it as a fail because we're still under what we should be. Um, I don't think we'll be spending anything tomorrow because my eldest four now with a dad for the weekend um so again you can't really see it because i'm putting my receipts in it to keep them for just basically to keep record for when i undo it all so it is my next 20 for tomorrow which again i don't think we're going to spend to be honest because we already have food in the freezer which i got a long time ago to be honest i've got like this um i've got a, like duck legs which i'm a bit uh, about duck i know i shouldn't 
like I'm not a vegetarian or out but it just makes me I don't know why it just makes me feel a bit sad um we've got some duck legs and we've got I've got some halloumi to make halloumi pasta and we have um what have I got so I've got like a beef curry in the freezer and Ryan got like a chow mein um so we've got plenty of um food in for the next few days um what I do sometimes when I go out shopping before this challenge I'd buy more for the weekends because obviously on a weekend it's only me Ryan and Imogen so right happy meal this is from budget looks um she now has a thing on a chat channel a page where you can buy is it four or five I think it's five actually of these insert um challenges I only got one but you can get four for £20 so if you're wanting a few of our challenges so I got the 4k one um and basically it's just all four is again I wanted this for actual savings um I just like it and I like the print and I think it's really pretty so I got it and then I got this haven one which is for our um holiday next year which I've been telling you all that we're gonna go on so it's like I didn't pay for the envelope she's put that in it um for me bless her so yeah that's what I got off Mal from the, she's changed her name it used to be budget looks but it's now the budget looks and she put Sal thank you good luck smashing 4k I know you do it Mal and then all the socials are that budget looks and she's really nice um and she has the best challenges really good quality really really bright and pretty and she's put in some stickers so she's put in you can do it um like a flower one plant is it and then like a snowflake one which i'm going to put with my other stickers what jasmine sent me yesterday so um i'm pretty sure that my daughter will probably end up stealing them from me because <laughs> yeah and again we're going to put it in the back of here although i'm thinking i'm gonna to have to move these challenges because it's starting to crunch a bit now because i've got that many in right i've took the challenges out so i've got my main sinking funds in here now because yeah i'm starting to ruin my actual envelopes in this one because it's too full so what i'm going to do is i'm going to pause it put them into another binder because i do have quite a few binders and um these challenges in here so i'll quickly recap that one needs to go in my sinking funds actually so i've got my five these are actual savings five ten twenty fifty two five ten twenty eight save a thousand my um seasonal ones and my 4k and my um dice they're the ones i'm working on along with my skull skull budget wand and my scratch my balls from um not dilly dally budgets that charlotte from dingley designs all right so i think i'm going to put them in this pink binder simply because i feel like the plastic ones are nice but if you have more i feel like they start to um not behave themselves if that makes sense so i'll quickly put them into this binder and then i'll come back and show you the finished binder when it's done right so this is the binder i'll probably get some vinyl maybe like savings on the side um i have i have actually got two of these pink ones because this is my low priority savings um pretty much empty at the minute because i've not been concentrating on this but I have got like another pink one of these and a black one. But I just feel like when there's a lot in it, they're better off with these like, you know, really robust ones. So I've put my 4K one at the front. Um, again, this will just get money as and when. It's not like got an end date. It's not got any goal. It's just, I just want to do it. It's a bit of fun. Um, and then I've got my 52 week challenge. My £5, £10, £20 challenge, 5 10 20 and my save 1000 all from planning with Ella. And then I've got my two seasonals and then I've got my roll and scratch. So my this one is going to my um, weekend away at Butlins in December. The rest, even though technically I could put in my other binder, but because it's pretty much not in use at the minute, I just want to keep all my challenges in this one. 
um but yeah we'll quickly put this into my high priority it is a holiday so it is a priority to me um And you know, just thinking about it, I do actually have one second, one minute, this envelope with some money in, £50, which I'm going to leave for now, which is for Haven, but I might put that into my, um, it's not for Haven, it's for Butlins at Christmas, I might put that into my scratch offs because that's what my, um, holidays for so my scratch off from Asia which is 450 and my seasonal ones which are 175 so what's that 350 plus 175 yeah so 525 and then I've got this one which again I'm going to plan to take with us um add 110 so that's 655 so I won't need to find much more money for our Butlins because the food's in with it, so well, most of it's in with it. Um, but you get two meals a day, like breakfast and tea, maybe I can't remember. I know that it's two, but I can't remember um, which ones it is. Well, yeah, I'll leave it there. <clears throat> if I don't end up spending any money tomorrow, I'll probably not do a video tomorrow. <clears throat> Sorry, I've just gone real hoss. Um, and I'll probably just wait until. And again, if I don't spend any money on Sunday, I'll probably just wait till Monday and just put the money in here um, because there'll be nothing to talk about. There won't be anything to tell you what I've bought. Um, I know on Monday we definitely need to buy something because I've got my kids back and I'll need to buy them um, bits and bobs and I need some cat litter as well. So, yeah, I'll see you all either tomorrow if we do spend something, even if it's just like a bloody bottle of Coke, I don't know, we might. But if we don't, I'll see you the next time I spend some it, which will probably be Monday because we don't really spend on a weekend. Um, please subscribe. I don't I have no issue asking you to subscribe because a lot of you are watching that aren't subscribed. It tells me. And please like the video because it really does help people um, see the video more. And with me posting more, of the, like my videos won't get pushed as much because there's like I've posted three this week alone but yeah it's just a bit of fun isn't it and um I know that I haven't saved much yet but hopefully I'll have some money saved on when we come back on Monday and I have no idea what I'm going to do with this money to be honest um might even just put it back into sinking funds house fund Christmas even though my Christmas is done but the other bits of Christmas um something like that look i cannot stop bloody gabbing for the life of me and i just want to say as well if you're not already can you go over to the canny tally um she's lovely she's a geordie living in ireland i'm sure you're already following her but if you're not she's hilarious she makes me laugh and she's so sweet and um yeah if you're not following her go over follow her. i'll leave a link down below zoe at the canny tally um she's just yeah she's she's very much like me she's got a brood of kids and um she's been through a lot lately and we're trying to get her to a thousand so go follow her and i'll see you all when i next see you bye